Okay, so I'm about two weeks behind, 10 days to two weeks. It's been snowing too many days to get this finished up, but uh, finally I've got this little machine ready to go to work. It's going to be moved out to the where it's going to spend the winter. It's an F3060, little Kubota. I just built this uh, little protector for the roof flasher. It's a steel piece of pipe that I, uh, I welded it right to the uh, roll bar. You can see the weld right there. And then I bolted on a little piece of flat bar to get it up to the top. Because the actual light's a bit smaller than the, than the opening. And I thought that, that seemed to seemed to work pretty good. I like it. And the uh, all the levers are in. A little switch box right here for the flashers and the lights. So there we go. That's what it looks like in the dark. Uh, I, there's nothing else really needs to be done to it for now. And uh, I think I'll show you my. Uh, my snowplow will take it off and put it back on. Okay, I'm back home. I think I need a new cutting edge. I, it's been a, it's the most worn out cutting edge I've ever, ever had, I think. But, uh, I'm gonna take this plow off and uh, we'll time it. We'll see how long it takes. Okay, I'll start my stopwatch just to see. I've never timed this, but I know it doesn't take very long. When this was new, this plow, the hardest part of the job was to unplug the three wires. That's under a minute. And we'll put it back on now. That's uh, two minutes and seven seconds. I don't know if you can see that. 207. I could have done it under two minutes, but I, I just didn't line it up on the first ap approach. When you pull up, it, you gotta be dead on or it'll, you'll know right away. But that's all there is to taking that off and putting it on, and unless it sinks in some ice. Usually it goes just like that, so very nice. And when the plow's off, the headlights, the light rack, everything comes off, except for the two pockets down here. But, uh, 
to you can see how that hooks on there this big hook pulls it on once that's locked on it won't come off pretty nice setup I think uh, Western have the best uh, hookup system that's probably the biggest reason why I bought this plow Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, I'm going to show you some more um, larger snowstorms. And uh, you could hit the subscribe button if you want, or leave a comment would be really nice. And uh, thanks for watching.